Hi, I'm Rome, and this is Barney Five. He's 21 years old. We both love we both love watching TJV. And you're watching Trucker Josh Vlog, best channel on YouTube. Hey everybody, another new day. We're off to pick up our final piece in uh, Nicolette, Minnesota. I slept in Moncato, 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 Minnesota. Just getting going now, making sure my trailer's not gonna fall off, making double, triple sure. Good, good, never want your trailer to fall off. And now we're gonna make our way to our pickup, just like 15 minutes down the road from here. And after that, I go home. So the sooner we get loaded, the better. Apparently, uh, I have three loads on me, three less than truck load loads. Uh, apparently with one of them, I've got to stop at US Customs before going to Canadian Customs. So it's gonna be a little different border crossing this time, but we'll figure it out. By the sounds of it, this won't take too long to load up this extra equipment. It'll probably take me longer to move my tarps and get them out of the way than actually get loaded and tie it down. I think I called in yesterday because I wanted to know exactly what they were putting on me so that I knew if I had enough room on my step, right? And uh, they said four pallets of aluminum parts. no problem right I told them all I got is like 11 feet or whatever on my step 10 11 feet unless it hangs over a little bit towards the back I mean I got a little bit more I maybe got 12 feet they said it shouldn't be a problem we pulled in here at Sock Center on our way through just for a little break grab a coffee Ding dong to you too, Karen. Is that your way of whistling at me? Cat calling me? I'm married, sorry. We've already established this. This is a working relationship, Karen. Don't be hitting on me. My wife's gonna get mad. All right, I appreciate this whole parade set up just for me here, but I'd like to go. Thank you. There we go. Let's get on to Interstate 94. very bot like Karen you better not be one of those Russian bots that would destroy our new relationship there can only be one Russian bot in this truck two is just way too many now we're about to cross into the legendary state of North Dakota we're going over the Red River here in the US they call it the Red River of the North crossing border entering North Dakota thanks Karen Mandy never told me when I was crossing state borders I like to see you like to be more involved in my day. I like that. Not too yappy, but you know. Make sure I don't forget where I am. Good morning, everybody. Another day at home, and it's time for a day of yard work. We gotta get everything mowed down. And if I have time this weekend, I'd like to start pulling deadfall out of our back bush out to burn it out here so that it's not sitting and rotting in our bush back there. We got quite a bit. I've shown you in past vlogs before and it's not good to leave it all back there. It's a little bit of a, you know, if lightning strikes, it could be a little bit of a tinderbox. So, plus it looks ugly. That's the main thing, it looks ugly. I want it to look better. So we'll see how much we get done. We at least got to get the lawn mowed. And I got to get some vlogs edited. Busy day, lots to do. So it's time to start getting rid of some deadfall again. I still haven't mowed the yard here yet, but I want to get this going. I'm going to mow this area here at the same time. Kill two birds with one stone. That way I can keep an eye on it. 
and get more done at the same time. Some more sticks back here that we gotta get. These are some that Britt and I have pulled out here. I think Britt pulled these out here. I don't remember doing this. I think Britt did this. Good job. She's been busy while I've been on the road working outside. She found a, a wasp nest or a hornet's nest, I think, in the bush over there. Found it the hard way. <laughs> I think she got stung like four or five times. Twice, two different days. <laughs> Tell you what, brave woman. She goes in there the one day, gets stung like four times. That doesn't stop her. There's a bunch of blueberries in here, right? And she wanted the berries. She's making pies and stuff. And uh, no, a couple of stings wouldn't stop her. She went back out there the next day. Showed them who's boss. Got stung again, but <laughs> Frank got stung too. We had to give him treatment right away, but he's okay. I think Chevy might have gotten it too, but they're all okay. And this is what I'm trying to take care of. Deadfall like this. There's a lot over there, a lot over here. I have no idea where this hornet's nest is yet. I'm gonna have to ask Britt. But so much deadfall back here. I'm gonna burn it all. It'd be good fertilizer for our garden next year, all that ash. So remember not too long ago when my cousin Will came and we cut down this massive big tree, it was dead. Cut down the dead tree and look at this. New life, already. That's pretty cool. Just to watch the cycle of life like that, eh? Through death comes new life. There we go, let's the, let that do its thing for a little while. Let's get some grass mowed and come back to it a little later. Good boy. Good boy. Do you see anyone out there? Is there somebody out there? Shh, mom's still sleeping. She's still sleeping, gotta be quiet. Gotta be quiet. Gotta be quiet. Gotta be quiet. Who's there? Hey, shh. Bad idea. Bad idea. Shh. Quiet. What was I thinking? Why did I say that? That was a terrible idea. That was my fault. And it's garbage day again. So garbage man Josh is on duty. He's got his trusty sidekick. Recycle Bear Brit. Recycle Bear Brit. <laughs> I like that. It just came to me. <laughs> so we gotta bring our garbage all the way into town and pay to drop it off too because uh, we don't get garbage service way out here in the middle of nowhere. I don't know what our taxes go to, but it must go to something. Somebody's getting rich. Absolutely. One of the politicians has a really nice place and a re some really good vacations for the bus. I'm glad we can contribute to his life. Or her. Or her. No, it's a he, right? Is it the Reeve? Who would it be? I don't know. We don't even know. They're taking our money. We don't even know who's taking our money. There we are. Go see the, the good old garbage people. The garbage gods. The garbage gods, yeah. They take all our garbage and put it somewhere else and bury it. And make it into beautiful rolling green hills. Exactly. Toxic rolling green hills. It'll be fun in winter. You can sled down them one, one day. I'm pretty sure that they don't open that up to the public here though. <laughs> oh, finally getting rid of this bad boy. The washing machine that could never be fixed? Yeah, that we bought with the house. And we had to go buy our own. It looks really fancy. It's a Samsung. You'd think that it would hold up forever. But apparently not. The dryer's still good, though. Many memories on this chair. <laughs> many a bonfire. So many memories, you broke it with them. Yep. Served me well. Rest in peace. <laughs> A little violent. <laughs> okay, this one's gonna be the fun one. I'm just gonna hop her in there. I'd love to help you, but I did a heck of a lot of lifting yesterday. I can barely even lift my shoulders. That's okay. I've been looking forward to this all day. All right, it's gonna go boom. Oh yeah, it will. Here we go. Oh, 
we go. All right. You ready? Ready. How satisfying. And then this is our old wheelbarrow. Remember, we got the new one. I was going to show you guys what happened to this one. Why we needed a new one. See, the frame rusted through and it broke. So our new one is uh, probably twice as big as this, it seems like. Well, we needed a new one before that, though, because there's a bunch of holes on the bottom. It wasn't very good yeah. for things like rock and, and, and sand and stuff and soil. Done? Done. All right. Put this thing back that was down. kind of impressive. I like watching you lift things up and put them down. I know. Ow. 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 Hello, everyone. It's Kieran from Trillac, BC, Canada. You are watching Trucker Josh Vlogs on TJV. Enjoy the video.